Phoenix A vs. Town 618, a journey into the depths of supermassive black holes. Welcome back to another episode of SciQuest, where we explore the fascinating world of space and the mysteries of the universe. Today, we are diving into the depths of two of the most massive black holes ever discovered, Phoenix A and Town 618. We will compare their properties, discuss the techniques used to study them, and explore the significance of these enigmatic cosmic phenomena in our understanding of the universe. So buckle up and join us as we venture into the heart of darkness. Let's start by taking a closer look at the Phoenix A black hole, also known as Helmbuck 15A. This colossal object is located at the center of the galaxy Humbug 15A, which resides within the Abel 85 galaxy cluster, which is about 700 million light years away from Earth, with an estimated mass of around 100 billion solar masses. Phoenix A is one of the most massive black holes ever discovered. The sheer size of Phoenix A and its host galaxy provide valuable insights into the role of supermassive black holes in galaxy formation and evolution. Studies have revealed signs of multiple past galaxies mergers, which are thought to have contributed to the growth of Phoenix A black hole. Now, let's travel to meet Tom 618, another massive black hole located in the center of a distant quasar, about 10.4 billion light years away from Earth. Tom 618 has an astonishing mass of around 66 billion solar masses. As the heart of one of the brightest known quasars, Tom 618 is an active galactic nucleus which means it's actively consuming surrounding matter and producing intense radiations. Observation of TAN-618 provide insight into the physics of acceleration and jet formation around supermassive black holes, as well as the relationship between black hole mass and host galaxy properties. When comparing Phoenix A and Town 618, we find that both black holes demonstrate the upper limits of black hole growth and challenge our understanding of these cosmic giants. While Phoenix A is located in a massive elliptical galaxy within a galaxy cluster, Town 618 lies at the heart of a distant, bright quasar. Both black holes have a significant impact on their host galaxies and neighboring regions, influencing star formation rates, disrupting the orbits of nearby stars, and even affecting the overall structure and evolution of their host galaxies. Despite their differences, the study of both Phoenix A and Tan 618 highlights the intricate relationship between supermassive black holes and the galaxies they inhabit. While studying these cosmic giants is no easy task, researchers rely on various ground-based telescopes like the European Southern Observatory's Very Large Telescope and the Keck Observatory, as well as space-based observatories like the Hubble Space Telescope and the Chandra X-ray Observatory to observe and analyze these black holes. Some of the challenges faced in studying supermassive black holes include their immense distance from Earth, which makes obtaining high-resolution images difficult, and in the case of Tan 618, its extreme brightness, which can outshine the host galaxy. So, the conclusion is, Phoenix A and Tan 618 are both fascinating objects that have the potential to provide valuable insight into a wide range of astrophysical phenomena. Continued study of these black holes using a variety of observational and theoretical techniques is likely to lead to many exciting new discoveries in the coming years. That's all for now. 
Thanks for watching. If you have any questions related to this video, make sure to leave us a comment and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.